previous teammates. This re this is a reality show, bro. This NBA shit is so phony. I'm not even happy with the win. I fuck the win. I don't give a fuck about this shit, bro. Yeah, they won. So what, nigga? They still got to win three more games, bro. But the way this game played out, bro, the NBA is a reality show. It shouldn't even came down to this possession anyway, nigga. The ball was out on Dylan Brooks on the fucking. Offensive rebound off of the missed free throw by Clay Thompson, and they don't even review that. If you don't, I thought under the two minutes, I thought they automatically review everything. I just, I don't understand this shit, bro. This shit is stupid. Curry missed a bunch of game winning shots. Wiggins terrible, no defense. He never contested one shot. Terrible, motherfucking. It, it just come on, man. This shit crazy. Clay Thompson missed two free throws at the end. The, and he missed them bad. That motherfucker off the back of the rim, bounce all the way up in the air, bro. This shit crazy. And then ejecting Draymond on a flagrant two. It's just crazy that you know what I'm saying. And then on that out of bounds play where the ball went under Wiggins' leg, the game should have never came down to that, bro. Because guess what? The review team they got to call the review. Why should Memphis lose a challenge and have to challenge a play with under two minutes to go in the fourth quarter? That's what they implemented the review for, bro. It just it don't make no sense. It was a bunch of calls. The block, the block charge foul on fucking Steph Curry where Dylan Brooks was clearly sliding over and Curry was trying to jump to the side to avoid the charge. And they gave Curry his fifth foul on that play. <sighs> Excellent. Good game. It was a competitive game, but I, the NBA is phony. It's so easy to see the fixes in these games. The players don't decide the games. The motherfucking referees decide these games, bro. This shit is crazy. Salute to Steph Curry defense on John Morant down the stretch. That play was big where he stripped him. He double stripped him. He got the initially on the gather, and then he poked it out when he was trying to go up. So great defense by Steph Curry. They say Steph Curry don't play D, so. Jordan Poole, shout out to Jordan Poole, man. Jordan Poole is huge. And the inexperience, I think, of this uh, of Memphis, you know what I'm saying, being in the second round, they never been here before with this squad. As Ja Morant's dad and Steph Curry. Oh, my goodness. And this shit, this shit is officially rigged up as Ja Morant's dad and Steph Curry got some sort of special relationship that I didn't know existed. And it's crazy that all of a sudden now that all of the celebrities are, you know what I'm saying, as here comes John ja Morant greeting all the players for the Warriors. This shit, this shit weird, bro. This shit is fucking weird. All of a sudden, we ain't seen John ja Morant dad, nigga. And last season, he was nowhere to be found when John ja Morant was winning Rookie of the Year. But all of a sudden now, John ja Morant dad is everywhere. The nigga know all the celebrities. Draymond Green is dressed in his club outfit. This shit crazy, bro. This shit is fucking phony as shit, bro. I hate this shit. I swear. This is not no real NBA. This is not the NBA I grew up watching, bro. And and it probably was rigged up way back in the day. But at least it wasn't clear as day, though. Teams really got after it and was fighting on the court. Referees didn't really play a huge part in that. And then a mafioso control all this shit. Dictate outcome of the game. Niggas be quitting. Niggas play lackluster one game. A nigga can have zero points. Steph Curry could shoot motherfucking five for motherfucking 18, right, in threes, one game. And then the very next game, the nigga 18 for 18. It don't make no sense. <laughs> like, that shit makes no sense, bro. Period. This NBA shit is phony baloney, bro. I mean, but they make so much motherfucking money, it don't even matter. So, my opinions don't matter. But it's a whole lot, hell of a lot of motherfuckers who look at this shit. This shit is phony baloney. The way Boston played today, they had like a 10-point lead where they looked like they was going to really put it on Milwaukee. And then at the end of the first quarter, Milwaukee just makes a run. And I'm like, what the fuck are they doing? And Giannis didn't play well. These niggas lost the fucking game by letting all these other weak-ass niggas live ball turnovers. And then free throw. It just, the shit was weird. This NBA shit weird, bro. I don't give a fuck about this win. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? At this point, it is what it is, bro. I don't even give a fuck, bro. I don't. This shit is super frustrating watching how these games play out. 
Just let the players play. And if I was the players, bro, fuck all the money. Fuck all the behind the scenes shit, nigga. Just play and give it your all. Every possession. That's why I love GP the second. G- GP the second not out there, nigga, playing to the fix. GP is playing his hardest. The smallest nigga on the court grabbing all of the rebounds. It's just crazy, bro. Well, it is what it is, man. It is what it is, bro. Warriors up 1-0. Oh, well. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. I don't care, man. This shit crazy. 